A moment of triumph dissolved into unspeakable heartbreak in the West Michigan community of Fenville. This is video from a month ago, 16-year-old Wes Leonard right here. The person shooting in this video drained the game's winning shot last night in overtime to clinch his high school basketball team's perfect 20-0 season. But moments after the 57-55 win, Wes Leonard collapsed on the court. A Holland Hospital spokesperson says paramedics performed CPR on Leonard before he was pronounced to dead at the hospital. A cause of death has not yet been determined. An autopsy is expected. For the last five years, Channel 7's Bill Spencer and Beaumont Hospitals have been working together to make it a mission to prevent tragic deaths involving high school athletes like the one you just saw. They've been offering student athletes free in-depth heart testing. And Bill joins us now from the newsroom with more on this. Now, Bill, how does this program work? How do you protect children from a sudden sports-related heart problem? Well, Alicia, let me tell you, first of all, that we are the only TV station in the entire United States to offer a program like the Seven Health Edge Heart Check. And we offer this program absolutely absolutely free thanks to Beaumont Hospital. Through the Seven Health Edge Heart Check, we put high school athletes through a whole battery of in-depth heart tests administered by real doctors who are all heart specialists. They are tests that would normally cost parents more than $1,000 if they had to pay for them, but we offer them absolutely free, and our testing goes light years beyond the typical high school sports exam kids get to find hidden heart defects that could kill your child without any warning. The difference between what we do in a typical sports exam is we do an in-depth evaluation of the heart. We look at the rhythm of the heart, and we also look at the structures of the heart with an echocardiogram. So we're looking actually in-depth at the heart itself to see whether or not there is a physical problem or a technical problem or a structural problem of the heart that we can be aware of and either stop the child from doing sports or correct. And without that, uh, you can't really detect a hidden heart defect, right? Correct. Without doing a electrocardiogram or an echocardiogram, we really have no other way to know whether or not there is a potential heart problem in these athletes. And we at Channel 7 will again offer the 7 Health Edge Heart Check coming up this spring for two days only on May 20th and May 21st. The location is yet to be determined. Continue to watch Channel 7 Action News because in the coming weeks we'll be telling you exactly how you can register your student athlete for this one-of-a-kind life-saving program which is designed once again to prevent unspeakable tragedies just like the one that happened last night. I'm Bill Spencer. Live in the newsroom. Such an important, great program that we offer along with Beaumont Bill. Thank you very much.